So pretty much once a week for the last four or five years, I've been coming from London up to Warrington to train with the Warrington Mills Physical Disability Rugby League team. It's changed my life. It's absolutely changed my life. For mental health purposes, as well as for physical purposes, it's just, we're all addicted to it. So this is it, Vicky Park. Peter, Adam, how are you? Yeah, right. right. How's you? Things? Yeah, good, good, thank you. Oh, nice to hear that. Nice to hear a Sydney accent <laughs> over here. Have you ever seen Disability Rugby League before? Uh, you know, I was, I was a big watcher of it last year. And then I think that's when I first seen you all over Twitter, like you are now. So, um, <laughs> it's great. I enjoy it. All right. So, I mean, I, I could say to you this is where the magic happens, but this is where you've trained as well, right? Because we trained here last week yeah. and literally that screw there fell out. So you find it on the pitch. I think we have. <laughs> I know it means a lot to the lads that you're going to come down and train with yeah. us tonight. Can't wait. Everyone, this is Peter. Make him feel really welcome. Haven't worked out what his disability is yet, but I'm sure he'll explain it. Let's go, lead it out. What did rugby league give to you? It changed my life and saved my life. My parents split up when I was 11. We ended up moving to Newcastle, but just the, the change and, and the opportunities it gave my family and I and my mother, um, it was immense. And how did it save your life? Just the amount of positivity and, and the community that got behind my family. You know, my mum brought up seven kids on her own. We couldn't get to training yet. There were other people in the team who, who were willing to do that. Oh, he's got him! People like me who's had a tough upbringing, you know, if the way I look at it is every time I, I get to wake up and keep pushing forward, you know, I'm, I'm giving hope to someone out there who, who, who's probably going through a similar stage where I did. What a run! Oh, he's circled him! Do you get that feeling? I mean, it's more than just a sport, right? Yeah, I do. You know, the, the younger kids are the next generation of our sport. You know, they're, they're going to be the difference whether our game grows or not. So it's really important for, for players who are playing right now to, to use our platform. What you guys do with these kids, it's um, pretty inspiring, man. And I'm interested that a coach's role in a team doesn't just end when you finish training or when the game's over. They're kind of almost there for you all the time. Yeah. 100%. It was a big reason why I came to Warrington. Um, I wanted to follow Pauli. I really enjoy um, what he's like, not just on the field, but off the field. He's a really caring person, and he knows that if you're happy off the field, the results will come on the field. Yeah. You know that saying, you know, happy wife, happy life. So, um, yeah, just, just being able to make sure you come into training happy, which obviously starts from how you are at home. And then whenever it is that you finish playing rugby league, what is it that you want to give back? After rugby, I want to be a life coach, a mindset coach. He's all passed better than the first team. <laughs> I firmly believe that, you know, your mindset is the key to success. And just to let people know that, you know, there's, there's always a way, you know, never quitting, never folding. Set, in. You're never alone. And I don't mean alone as in, you know, you're by yourself. Hold it together as a team, as a team. You're not the only person going through what you're going through. Good work, lads. All right, straight to. I feel like everyone deserves a chance to, to fulfill their full potential or live the life they want. Great catch, great pass. At the moment, I'm just ticking over that when I get spare time from, um, from rugby, but I enjoy it. And like I said, I love giving back. Oh. <laughs> hey, you didn't say you had a right foot on the tip sheet. <laughs> it was outstanding, man. All the characters in the team, I found it pretty fun. and. I enjoyed jumping in the banter and so uh, it was great. Good session tonight boys, yeah. A lot, a lot of fun in it as well, all right? So well done. Hey guys, I just want to say thank you for having me tonight. Thank you for inspiring me and others out there. And um, good luck for the rest of the season. Nice to you in there. How many of the lads want to see game? One, two, three, four! Cheers, bro. Now, let's see if we can find that screw. 